Good afternoon, my name is Sean Spicer. Many of you know me from the RNC. But now I've got a quite important job telling you what's happening at the T.O.P. But before we discuss any news of substance, I've got something that I have to say That regardless of the numbers you've reported You've got it all wrong, this was the hugest Inauguration day This was the largest audience to ever witness an inauguration, period Both in person and around the globe these attempts to lessen the enthusiasm of the inauguration are shameful and wrong. I should be the one you're listening to. He should as well if he only knew. As his conscience, I should have kept him from this job. But there's only so much that I can do. You want to hold him so accountable. I'm here to say we'll hold you to the American. Deserve better than this The fake media's got such a globalist view And his crowd was the biggest too We can stand this globalist view Or at least the one that comes from the top As long as I serve as the messenger, it'll be foolproof He'll attack you, tell you fables like a song Since we can trust you to deliver it straight We'll go to his crowd, we'll skip the shrews Using Twitter bully tactics, he will decimate Anyone who goes against him with the global Mr. Kami. I didn't know this was a private dinner. That's okay, now you owe me. Lots of people would love to have your job, and there's some things we should discuss. Are you sure this is the time and place? Why not? I'm the boss, and I need to know who I can trust. This seems a little strange. I expected a bigger crowd. The things we need to talk about need not be spoken aloud. As you know, I'm under great shame with this investigation hanging over my head, so I need to know where I stand, because evidence you haven't assured me. But it took a lot of cuts to do what you did back in October. I made the election when you became a conspiracy promoter I was not a big fan when you exonerated Crooked Hillary But you did the right thing for going any kind of chivalry You reopened a close case a week before Unfit for the 
her position Although she was cleared a few days later We know the damage was sufficient Now I'm fast to here To discuss our strange relationship Unconditional loyalty is what I expect Although I'm merely a presidential counterfeit I need to know if I'm under investigation If you go up away, you'll be rewarded And I know that your ambition Didn't do those things for you I was just doing my job And it makes me sick every time I think That I might have created this mob I could never promise loyalty It's just not how it works on the hill I can only promise honesty And I know what I'll do to distill The situation I must write every single word I must write down everything I've heard They're in the theater of the absurd And I know I'll need to do something I must write every single word Everything that he's inferred It's time for this to be deferred I can't just wish it away This crooked dollar play Same views, although of me he's kind of leery. But he's got a grudge against Obama and Hillary. Bonus, he retweets conspiracy theories. His speech at the convention proves us it from the Republican gun. You know, he relished the moment when they chanted lock her up. Call him Powell, call them a right wing nutty, although he's a Democrat. As long as he follows our lead, he can continue as a Turkish he diplomat. He was actually a lobbyist under investigation. Obama warned us he couldn't be trusted, ignored his defamation. The day he punished Russia for election interference, then called him back to the circuit five times as a man that he's got the clearance. We all agree that DC is corrupt, but we'll back him from within. I'm making quite a bundle to America chagrin. To hell with the wages of sin in like them. For Putin, nothing new, it's now routine Flynn sat with him at dinner To honor the government-owned propaganda machine At a time of increasing tensions U.S. press can't believe what they've seen But the Russians paid him the media's fake He's keep track of that video He's tape. also got Pence's back Cause he knew the whole deal He said he had no idea about Turkey and Russia And Flynn, the facts were concealed But we know the whole truth As his nose he was thumbing Last November by Congressman Elijah Cummings AG8 said he could be blackmailed by the Russians But she was gone after the Muslim ban Check out those repercussions We know he discuss sanctions But I'll surely never admit That we met with the King of Jordan About a nuclear weapon starter kit We all agree that DC is corrupt But we'll back him from within Making quite a bundle to America chagrin. To hell with the wages of sin. In like a man. Russia, just my battle's in the air. 
Desmond, Miller, and Bannon, but he's got a few more companions he can't abandon. Because the members of his reality show royal family and the cousin are national calamity. The family business owns the money, laws are passed to help themselves, and although one isn't officially, still accumulates wealth. The cousins still war like the one in Sri Lanka, introducing Kushner, Jr., and Ivanka. They're out to make history. It's really no mystery. Skirting every damn law. What about the emoluments clause? The passing laws that make him rich. The dad's a son of a bitch. And every lie that he tells just brings him closer to hell. Take it back to the Arab sheets. 
Take it back to that meeting in June. Take it back to Harvester and the Just gotta need my bath some dirt on Crooked Hillary. We could meet some Russians, we do business with them now and me. The Kremlin's been checking out dad since 87. They can take it to the White House, we'll be in heaven. His name's a mean, I got Lara Russian pops out who's admired. Dad was in his video shouting his cat trays of fire. His father's down with Putin, they met at Miss Universe. When dad entered dressing rooms, they say that that's reverse. Send a lawyer named Natalia, she's well connected. Worked a Monday longer in case I can help her when he's elected. Paul Manafort will be there, a means publicist too. I told dad we can get him something he can use. So he's ready to announce his followers on Twitter that the Clintons are involved with some Russian heavy hitters. But you'll have to scratch his meat and undisclose your form. When you're a White House advisor, although that's the norm. And yo, I got a crazy Twitter from WikiLeaks about a website dedicated to conspiracy freaks. I said I'd ask around now that I got the password. They'd be harassed by our followers that pops been stirred. And they're releasing stolen emails from the DNC. They asked me for help spreading their philosophy. And that the Democrats are cooking, so is Hillary. Hey, Junior, you know the meaning of hypocrisy? And I can't stand traitors like every Democrat Who goes against me on the wall I'll build it so high and transparent So the bad hombres won't hit you with a sack of eight balls We're gonna build that damn wall I'm here to introduce the cabinet I'll anoint you have no say in this matter, the best and brightest I'll appoint. Then I'll ask you for your blessings, for those that need approval. And if you cross me, look out on Twitter, cause I'll demand your removal. Though although I claim on the campaign trail with grandiosity and power, I'm the change of the guard, a populist at heart. As I soak up the sun I've created a new office For immigrant crime So we can rid the country of rapists and killers This lies and dies every damn time I can't believe it It's gonna be on your dime I can't believe it I've used executive powers To institute a Muslim ban when it comes to this, that's why they're in my clan They just dropped the Saudis in Egypt because of my business deal Even though the homes of the 9-11 hijackers They were cheering in Jersey and that is real and though I claimed on the campaign trail With grandiosity and power And I'm the change of the God, a populist at heart I'm really just a narcissist that's playing the ball
So without further ado, I'd like you all to acknowledge this group of ill-equipped anti-government billionaires. Some barely made it through college. But since I need to hit the links, Spicy will take over the hijinks. And this government from inside we will demolish. You all know Pence, he's the cream of the crop and a loyal vice president. He's a little bit dense and I'm really quite concerned about just what he represents. He's an educated man with high moral standards and he even has a lot of green. Same school as Dan Quayle, who in one word summed up the VP's responsibility. And that one word is to be prepared. prepared. Back to Pence. He never wanted the position, but he was getting ready to lose his sentency. Back in the day, he used campaign funds for credit cards, his mortgage, and even groceries. So when I LGBTQ, the so-called president joked that he's down for hanging now. He even got an earful when he went to go and see Alexander Hamilton. No dinner, no drinks, along with a woman afraid of sexuality. But he's a tiebreaker in Congress, so he can confirm any nominee. We'll go head to head with Obama. The Russian ambassador and he won't resign He thinks the NAACP is on American racism in his bloodline He believes in mass incarceration, private prisons And he thought the KKK were okay until he found out they smoked pot So let's talk about Russia and Exxon And Secretary of State Rex Tillerson He's a fine man, Putin gave him all of friendship He's not banned with the nitroglycerin Then once he had him when he travels without the press He went to Asia with just the journal review the best thing you'll do is call the so-called president a fucking moron in Act 2. He had no regard for sanctions on Russia and only got a slap on the wrist. Forget those lost climate change emails from an alias account. And he account. packed Bush and now you know who's pissed. We'll go head to head with Obama's or any other cabinet in history. You know he's really from the Bahamas and Alex Jones just uncovered this mystery Head to head will win using sophistry I'm a little worried about Priebus, the chief of staff He was an honest team and I don't think he'll laugh He asked him to drop out of the election after Access Hollywood Before my RNC comrades, I hope he does what Steve Mnuchin, he's got a gorgeous wife, his third, just like Beatty. Bows around with a Brett Ratner, we've got a lot in common. These are the money guys, I know what I said about Goldman Sachs, but in those particular positions, I just don't want a poor person. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? If you insist, I'll do it. But I like it better this way, right? Go head to head with Obama's, or any other cabinet in history. Alex Jones just uncovered this mystery Head to head will win using sophistry And you know we'll undermine them eventually Ryan Ziggy, Secretary of Interior, a lot of them called Crooked Hillary the Antichrist And he flip-flops on global warming, this he believes, and now he does it, and now's what counts And with his help, I'll be the first in history to eliminate national monuments that were created by my British Ben Carson, housing and urban development. He's just like me. He likes to stretch the truth and he won't avoid directing tax dollars to my businesses. 
Sonny Perdue, Secretary of Agriculture. Wow, he knows how to work the system. As Governor, he was involved in shady land deals, tax dodges, and proper campaign contributions, and he tried to bring back the Georgia state flag with Amber of the Confederacy. My kind of guy. Tom Price, Secretary of Health and Human Services. I know he said I would be dangerous for politics and the economy, but I still don't believe he benefited from those stock transactions, do you? Hell, I got rid of Preeper, I just for you. Just watch those private planes, Tom. You and Mnuchin.